Gertrude Stein came to Paris in 1903 to join her brothers Leo and Michael. As the Stein family built up the world's first collection of modern art, Gertrude began to write in earnest. Gertrude Stein, rich in enthusiasm but modest in means, and then about as unknown as a writer as Picasso was as a painter, began her famous and eclectic Picasso collection. For her first Picasso, she and her brother Leo paid 150 francs, and all three quarreled about the picture's merits. It was an early, exquisite, conventional nude. Miss Stein, who was already ripe to prefer stranger sights in art, thought the girl looked classically flat-footed. From 1906 to 1909, the Stein family controlled the Picasso output, since no one else wanted it. Janet Flanner, an American in Paris. As Gertrude and Leo's collection grew, people called at 27 Rue de Fleurie to see the curious paintings. These gatherings developed into an informal Saturday night salon at which Matisse and Picasso were frequent guests. Picasso, in particular, loved the international flavor and sexual ambiguity of the evenings. Then, in 1907, Gertrude Stein met Alice B. Toklas.